Now, today's top stories and Power of Five weather from News 5, sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. Good Tuesday morning, I'm Katie Houston. And I'm Danita Harris. Here's a look at your top local stories. Terrifying video out of East Akron where a 16-year-old fought off a man who was trying to kidnap her. She was able to get away, and now we're waiting for the suspect in this case to make his fir first court appearance this morning, and we're hearing from that teenage girl's mother. Mommy, somebody just tried to take me, horrified. It just brought tears to my eyes. The girl's mother remembering that phone call she got from her daughter after it all happened. Police say the girl was waiting for an Akron Metro bus around 6.30 Friday morning when the stranger came up to her, took her phone, put her in a bear hug and tried to drag her to a car. But the girl was smart. She held on to a fence and refused to let go. The man gave up and took off. Police made an arrest a few hours later. New information on that recent resignation of the Cuyahoga County Sheriff. We found out his announcement came as a surprise to his deputies. Sheriff Christopher Vyland is the third sheriff to step down in four years. He was sworn in just over a year ago. The union for the deputy says that they just want consistency after the recent revolving door in that position. When a new sheriff comes in, my deputies want to kind of get to know this guy, want to know what his plans are, what's his mission. What does he want to do with the department? And, you know, a year later, he's already leaving. Sheriff Byland wrote in his resignation letter that he is thankful for the opportunity and will use accrued leave for personal and medical issues. A year-long initiative to help bring financial wellness to communities who need it the most kicks off today. The Key Bank Key Bus will be visiting cities all over Northeast Ohio during the month of May, and it starts things off with a ribbon-cutting ceremony in downtown Cleveland. Inside the bus, you'll find TVs and computers where you can participate in self-guided financial wellness programs, job searches, career modules, and even build your resume. All right, let's check in with Kate McGraw to see uh, what's happening outside. It's mostly cloudy. Cool, but rainy and warmer. I mean, even some storms later today. Thanks to this warm front that's sliding through timing here, it looks like we'll see increasing showers throughout the mid and late morning. Thunderstorms become more likely after two and continue into this evening. We could see some strong to severe storms, including damaging winds. Heavy rain that could lead to flooding should wrap up early tomorrow with cooler temperatures returning. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.